memorable career moment was walking to the Apollo Theater and looking up at the marquee and seeing that it said Roxanne Chante featuring Rick James. And I was like, <gasps> and I remember rushing inside of their office because Rick James was getting ready to pull up. And I remember, well, he wasn't getting ready to pull up. He was gonna be there shortly. And I remember rushing into their office and running up the steps and telling them that they had to change that marquee. But that was after I got a picture of it. But I went and told them, you gotta change that marquee. Because just from the way I was raised and my respect for music, there's no way in the world that can say Roxanne Shante featuring Rick James, Lucy's rap. There's just no way that can say that. So I need you to turn that around. And I remember the lady, Miss Flowers, who worked there. She already had the letters. And this was back when you put the they put the letters up there before it got all electronic, when they would put the letters up there. And I remember her having the letters already set to the side. And she said, I told them that you were gonna say that. Go and change the letters. She said, I, I knew that you were gonna say that. And, and I did, and I made sure that they changed it before he came so that he could see that it said Rick James featuring Roxy and Shantae, Lucy's rap. Because I just wasn't going to participate in being able to try to break one of our greatest entertainers, producers, there was just no way I was going to be part of any memory of that whatsoever. And this was at a time when I think that, you know, maybe he might have been going through something with the record company and record companies can be very spiteful when they want to be in order to try to break an artist. And I wasn't going to participate in that. So for me, that has to be one of my proudest moments because I think I was more um, impressed with the fact that Miss Flowers knew that I was going to come and change that. So she already had the letters ready for me. And so, and I'm glad that we did that because I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have slept well if I would have let that stay. But I did take a picture of that shit on a 35 millimeter camera. Yes, I did. And I, yes, I did take a picture of it. I mean, just, just to have, cause it was just incredible to know that I had even reached a height where that could be possible. And, um, you know, so for my own keepsake. So yeah, that would be it. If I had to say which star knew me and it was surprising to me, I was overseas in London. And when I looked at the bill, I was performing with Martha Rees and the Vandellas. And see, I like all types of music. I like all generations of music. So I knew who Martha Reason and Vandellas was. He waved, to my he waved. So, you know, I knew, so I was hyped. I was like, oh yeah, I'm getting ready to, you know, I'm gonna perform with Martha Reason and Vandellas. I don't know how we wound up on the same bill, but listen, it works for me. And when she came over to me and she said, I said, she said, um, yeah, you know why? I said, yes, I know who you are. I said, heat wave, burning through my, heart. and she said, yeah, cause I know who you are, Roxanne, Roxanne. I wanna be your man. I said, I made it. I made it. Martha Reason and Vandellas know me. Let me call my mother. <laughs>